quick graph y equals x squared minus 3 by hand two different ways. This is part of the family of functions series. So you're going to graph this using what I call the parabola dance. And normally we'd start at the origin, but because of the minus 3, we need to shift each point down 3 units. So we're going to start at 0, negative 3. And from there we'll do the parabola dance, which is right 1, up 1, because 1 squared is equal to 1. Right 2, up 4, 2 squared is 4. Right 3, up 9, because 3 squared is 9. And then from that same vertex, we'll go left 1, up 1, because the quantity of negative 1 squared is 1. Left 2 up 4, the quantity of negative 2 squared is 4. And left 3 up 9, the quantity of negative 3 squared is 9. We can go ahead and connect the points and make a beautiful parabola. And I'd like to compare that to the parent function, y equals x squared. And you'll notice that from the blue to the green, it's down 3 from that point, down 3 from that point, and actually down 3 from every single point. The second way is using a table. So we're going to start off with the traditional y equals x squared table, those five points. And here's our table of x squared minus 3. We're going to subtract 3 from each of the y coordinates, again, because it's right there in the equation. So 4 minus 3 will be 1, and that point 2 comma 1 is plotted there. 1 minus 3 is negative 2. 1 comma negative 2 is plotted. 0 minus 3, 0, negative 3. 1 minus 3 back to negative 2, negative 1, negative 2. And 4 minus 3 is 1, negative 2, comma, 1. Again, we'll connect the points and compare it to the parent function.